Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we are going to construct a pattern profile in Autodesk Inventor Sheet Metal. In this we will use the counter flange command and fold and unfold command. So let's get started with today's tutorial. Go to new. We will take sheet metal part in millimeter and go to create. Now go to 2D sketch and select the xy plane now select the line command and from here make a line ok first we will make a rough sketch escape and now go to arc command and make an arc profile over here and line command same profile ok now escape now we will go to dimension and we will give a vertical dimension as 35 mm zoom out and this dimension will be 20 and the radius will be 25 mm ok now escape we want to give the same dimension to this side also so go to equal constraint select this line and select this line they are equal similarly select this line and select this now they are also equal now escape now to make it constrain go to vertical constraint select this center point and select this point ok the horizontal constraint select this point and select this select this and select this ok similarly we want ok now we will check how this is not constrained ok now you can see this line is moving upward they are not in the same plane these two lines so go to horizontal constraint select this point and select this point ok and select the bottom and this center point ok now the sketch is fully constrained always work in fully constrained sketch now finish sketch and go to counter flange go to front view we want the sheet metal profile so should be inside the sketch from here you can switch the direction you can flip the side the sheet metal will come outside we want it inside ok go to home and the distance will be 250 mm and we want it asymmetric as we do it with extrude go to symmetric from mid plane 125 this side and 125 mm this side and ok ok now we will change the sheet metal thickness from sheet metal default here the by default thickness of sheet metal is 0.5 m so uncheck this and here write it 2 m and apply you can see the thickness has changed here exit from this command now we want to make the cut profiles we want to make these cuts for that go to unfold select this face as stationary face and all bends will be unfold and apply ok now go to top view and select this middle plane or face Go to create sketch from here select the center point slot or center to center slot you can select ok now go to dimensions the center line dimension will be 145 mm and the radius of this slot will be 5 mm 
the slot from this end will be the center line 15 mm okay now we have to align it escape from this command and go to vertical constraint select this midpoint and select midpoint of the slot okay okay something okay this is this midpoint is not the same we will select this point so undo this and go to vertical constraint select this midpoint and select here the midpoint of the sheet okay now this is perfect in middle okay now we want to do the pattern so go to rectangular pattern or first make a reference go to project geometry and select this line okay this will be the reference now go to rectangular pattern and select this slot profile okay go to direction one and select this reference line as you can see it is going upwards so from here flip the direction here you can see and we will give a count of 12 and the center to center gap will be of 20 okay and okay now this will be the profile finish sketch and from here go to 3d model and select the x2 and we will make a window and select complete profiles go to home as you can see it is extruding outwards but we want to make a cut profile so from here go to cut and ok now this profile is made now we will go to unfold this or refold back so go to sheet metal and go to refold select this reference and select all bends now to refold it back and apply so it will take some time due to profile ok now you can change the view you can rotate it from here shift plus rotate escape from this command and you can select this from here you can give change the color I will give it cyan to make a, a flat pattern of this go to create flat pattern and it will provide the flat pattern as we have seen the view in unfold now go to folded part so this was a basic tutorial to how to construct a pattern profile in a curd feature in Autodesk Inventor. I hope you like the video. If you do, do, do that, please do hit like and subscribe the channel for more such videos. Thank you.